You seem like uh, your teammates give you a lot of energy. Oh yeah. You know. like, when I see my teammates turn it up, like that's that's a good thing. Like, it's just not it's just me on the team. I want to see my guys eat too. So we, that's what we did today. Everybody was getting buckets. I just like to just stop them in that regard and just like just lock them down, just play my best D I can, just show I can play deep both sides of the ball. Is there anyone you pay attention to defensively in the NBA or uh, I've watched a lot of Kawhi. Yeah, he really played good D, so I just try to compare it to that. Um, and any other players you model your game after? Uh, just KD. That's it, yeah. Do you get tired of the KD comparisons? I mean, people make it all the time. Do you like it? you get tired of it's it? Whatever. It's, it's cool at the same time, but like, it's whatever. Just being compared to an NBA player, that's like, not everybody you know, has an opportunity compared to KD. Do you think it's a fair comparison? I mean, obviously, you're young, but. Yeah, but uh, I kind of think it is just because how long I am and how long he is. We're both versatile players, so I think we can make that comparison. So, sort of on that note, I mean, do you feel like you're kind of coming around to the NBA at the right time? You know, so many big guys are sort of skilled. And yeah, like, like you know, there's not a lot of like just big postmen. Like big men are out like, on the big one line now. You have to do everything. So I feel like we're coming in sort of like, What do you What do you feel like you have to work on the most? Uh, sort of just going to college and then beyond. Uh, just getting stronger and then just mastering my craft. Just make sure everything's good. My jump shot hand. Against the baskets, get better every day. So positionally, you see yourself playing on the perimeter more, or yes, uh, you don't like inside, inside out, and uh, pose, mm -hmm. come out the three-point line, do whatever. What do you think of Aiden, the big kid going to Louisville? What kind of challenge was that for you? Well, it was good. He's just super strong. Like, just gotta trust my teammates to help me out if something happens. So he's a good player. Now speaking of college, like. What does the school have to have to land the services of Jaden McDaniels? It's just like, I just have to have a good relationship. Like, the players I'm going to come in with and the coaches, just, that's big for me, just having a great relationship with people. What did you learn uh, last year with your brother going through the pre draft process? Like, you have to, like, they watch everything. Like, NBA watch, they just watch like, how you, like, go walk to get water, all type of stuff. It's just not playing the court. They watch everything. Did you see Carmelo walk out there? Oh, uh, yeah. It's crazy, like everybody going crazy, showing love to him. It's real nice. How come he didn't come out at the beginning of the game? What's up with that? He should have been here earlier. <laughs> <laughs>